The data world is always changing, right? So let's count down the top 10 technologies for 2025. All right, kicking things off at number 10, LLMs and vector databases. Think of it as the AI's brain and memory. Why does this matter? Well, this is your key to building those next-gen, super smart AI apps. Coming in at number nine, we've got Apache Airflow. It's the king of automating complex data workflows. Basically, it keeps your data flowing smoothly and reliably, no matter how complicated things get. At number eight, we have Terraform. This is huge. It lets you build your entire data setup with code. It's a concept called infrastructure as code. So you get consistent, error-free setups every single time. Number seven is a classic that's only getting more powerful. Yep, we're talking about SQL. And getting good at advanced SQL, it means faster queries, better performance, and saving a ton of money. All right, number six is all about real-time data. And for that, you need Apache Kafka. Seriously, everyone wants instant insights, which makes knowing Kafka a super valuable skill. Kicking off the top five, it's Kubernetes. That's what connects data engineering with operations. This is now the go-to for building tough, scalable data systems that can grow with you. And at number four, we've got Snowflake. It's totally changed the game for cloud data warehouses. Its magic is separating storage from compute. That means you get crazy scalability and speed. Cracking the top three is DBT. Honestly, this tool has completely revolutionized analytics engineering. What it does is bring solid software engineering practices, like testing, straight into analytics work. Our runner-up at number two, you guessed it, it's the undisputed champ, Python. With libraries for everything, Python is really the backbone for the entire data workflow. And the number one data technology you need to know for 2025 is Apache Spark. Why Spark? Its in-memory processing crushes big data tasks up to 100 times faster than the old ways. So there's your roadmap. The only question left is, what are you going to tackle first?